Alright, come on everyone, gather around, it is time to have fun with science! As you may know, I am Dr. Bunsen Honeydew, and this is my longtime loyal laboratory assistant, Beaker! Also with us are our intrepid interns. Let's have a hand for Newton and Einstein! Yes! We are from Muppet Labs, where for many years I've created inventions to make everyone's life easier. Right, BD? We've been invited by Mr. Mickey Mouse himself to share some of the groundbreaking work going on at Muppet Labs and to get you excited about science. Are you excited about science? Let me hear you! Yay! To bring the thrill of the lab directly to you, I've invented this most remarkable vehicle. Introducing the Muppet Mobile Lab! Yes! Thank you for that unsolicited applause. It fuels our passion for science. Unfortunately, Beaker's passion seems to be out of gas. You see, Beaker has decided to leave Muppet Labs. Anyhow, I guess it's no secret that I value my relationship with Beaker very much. He's always been my best friend. I like to see you go, Beaky. Miss you too. Oh. Yes, all right, Beaker, that's enough. There's no crying in science. Well, folks, I may not see my colleague Beaker here for a long time. Yes. His bags are packed, and he's decided to take a long trip. Now, I always, I always say, science makes your life easier. That's why this next invention is perfect for Beaker's big trip. I'm proud to share with you the Vacation Tron. With the Vacation Tron, you can travel to exotic locales instantly and never have to pack a suitcase. Allow me to demonstrate. No, relax, Beaker. Oh, it's, this experiment is as safe as anything we've ever done at Muppet Labs. Here we go, first off to merry old London, England. And it can't be England without fog. London fog. Yes, fog so thick, you won't even know you're not really in England at all. Next comes a trip to Alaska. That's right, Alaska! Ice cold Alaska, where the temperature cools and snow is all around. There, honestly, it's only snow. Next up, Africa. That's right, Africa! To see the most famous waterfall in the entire world, Victoria Falls! <laughs> And finally, we travel to Indonesia. That's right, Indonesia! A country with more volcanoes than anywhere else in the world! There we are! Yes, a trip around the world in under one minute and a half. Isn't science fun? Let me hear you! Well, Beaker, after seeing what it's like out there in the world, you'll probably want to stick around after all, eh? What? The experiment made you want to leave all the war. Dear, that plan backfired. Well, everyone, it looks like Beaker really is leaving Muppet Labs, but we'll have to continue the search for his replacement soon. First, though, I think, Beaker, it would be fitting if you were to share some parting words with us. Everyone, would you like to hear Beaker say what's in his heart? Yeah! I think Beaker could use even more encouragement than that, so let's chant his name, everyone. Come on! Beaker! 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 You hear that, Beaker? The floor is yours! you so articulate. Everyone wasn't that fantastic. Let's see a show of hands. Who was deeply moved by Beaker's speech? Let's see those show of hands. Oh, there's quite a few people here that were. 
Newton, I'd like to talk to someone here who was moved by what Beaker had to say just now. Oh, boy. Hello. Hello. Nice to meet you. What's your name? Philip. Oh, excellent. What did you think of what Beaker had to say? Um. Not much, huh? <laughs> you were what? He was to say. Oh, my goodness. Well, that's amazing, eh? Well, how old are you? Six. Ah, nice to meet you. What's your name again? Ah, nice to meet you. Let's give this young man a round of applause, everyone. Thank you for your thoughts and words. Who else was moved by Beaker's speech? Let's talk to someone who, uh, a little more articulate. Hello. Nice to meet you. What is your name? Mary. Mary? Yeah. Excellent. What was your favorite part of the speech? Um, uh, you said the science is for girls. That was gold, wasn't it? <laughs> You know what, we may be on the same wavelength here, Mary. I just have a few questions. You might have the future of a future laboratory assistant. Where are you from, Mary? From Washington State. Me too! And what's your favorite color? Red. Me too! We do have a lot in common. And one more question, what's your middle name? Sam. Me too! <laughs> Actually, no, that's not my middle name. But that is my cat's name. Hey, I think we have a search over now, everyone. Yes, we have a new laboratory assistant and a new best friend. It's Mary, right? Let's chant her name. Mary, 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 Mary. Beaker, you can come down from there now. We have found your replacement. No, Einstein, don't uh, help him down from the lab. Einstein, go ahead. Don't be so jealous, Beaker. Remember, this is what you wanted. I Beaker, what do you think you're doing? Beaker! No, you're going to wreck the lab, Beaky. Beaker! Oh my goodness, what do you mean you've changed your mind, Beaker? Oh, is that a But I thought you said you wanted to leave just now, Beaker. Now you want to stay? Oh, really? You mean it? Oh, Beaker, that's wonderful news. I knew you would never leave me. Mary, thank you for your help today. You'll make someone a wonderful laboratory assistant. Give Mary a round of applause, everyone. Excellent. And how about another round of applause for Beaker? He's back, everyone! Perhaps together we should show these fine folks one last invention before we leave. What do you think, everyone? But just show how much fun science can be. Are you ready? Excellent. Ladies and gentlemen, for those of you affected by the onslaught of colds and allergies, I am excited to introduce the anti sneeze ray. Sneezes will soon become a thing of the past with the help of Beaker here, who will be our test subject. Now I simply pull this lever to release a carpet dust, and then we add a little bit of cayenne pepper to the mixture. Feel that urge to sneeze yet, Beaker? Let it build because the mighty invisible beams from this powerful ray gun will stop the sneeze dead in its tracks. It works! The anti-sneeze ray really works! Success! Hooray! <laughs> Side effects of this invention may include losing your wardrobe. That's all the time we have for now from Muppet Labs. But thank you all for being such a wonderful audience. Can I get you back?